just over in Olympia. And, uh, wanted to just test off this lens. It's a little tilted. I need to adjust this a little bit. All right. Anyway. While I was doing all this, I wanted to just talk about a few subjects. First off, I think all bathrooms and changing rooms and such should be made co-ed. I know that, that that answer is not very acceptable by a number of people. I even heard some guys say that uh, they they wouldn't be able to pee if there was a woman in the room. I'm like, are you serious? And there's the obvious other issues that, you know, feminists would probably have a problem with. But I think that's the answer. Whether it be bathrooms, changing rooms, whatever. They're just bathrooms. They're just changing rooms. They shouldn't be gendered. I mean, when you really look at it, what's the difference between that and a white bathroom or a black bathroom or, you know, we're all just people. It's what we called it in childhood. When, you know, Here comes the cloud tunnel, the cigarette cloud tunnel. Oops, sorry. And you are, and I go, no, I'm not. Now, what some of the issue also is, is how There are some trans people who demand that they be treated a particular way. That they be looked at a particular way. I just want to treat everyone as humans. But some people are expecting everyone to look at them like, well, you were born that way. And I'm like, well, even as a gay man myself, I, 
you know, I question whether it's actually genetic. I think personally that we have the we can have the genetic predisposition to be bi and then our whatever scenarios we have lived under, whatever our environment is, is what decides the rest. But I don't have anything to prove that. So I don't like making blanket statements like that. So... Maybe it's genetic, maybe it's not. Maybe with trans people it's genetic, maybe it's not. Who knows? I just know you should treat people like humans. I mean, as long as someone isn't hurting other people, what difference does it make? Any of it make? And if someone is some sort of pedophile, they're, whether they look like a man or a woman, or even if someone was posing as a man or a woman, The thing that's wrong is someone going through with pedof their pedophile, pedophile tendencies. So that's the part that's wrong. And that sort of thing will be that sort of thing is illegal already. So why, why does there have to be, why do we have to promote intolerance and hate towards people for looking different? Again, whether or not it's genetic, I mean, what difference does that make? Anyway. Now I'm just on the other side of the street, just walking back the other way. tilting a little bit, isn't it?
shit. How's it going? How you doing? Doing Enjoy good. My huh? Enjoy my night. Yep, me too. <laughs> me too. Take it easy. Hey, you too. does really good karaoke.
wake up working, waking up and be like, damn, yeah, I did it. I'll be waking up like, nah. Uh, I'll be like, come on. Hey, thanks. We'll get in there. Hey, hey, whoa. 